And now Matt is back with a recipe that's the bomb. Tomato bomb, that is. It's like 1997 called. Here's what you need to follow along. You need cherry tomatoes, chickpeas, canola oil, tahini paste, a lemon, some salt, some pepper, some feta cheese, and some fresh mint. Hey, Matt, welcome back. Uh, let's blow everyone away with the tomato bombs. How do we start? Let's blow them away with our tomato bombs. I love it. So seasonal, it is now. So Trace, by chance, do you have a garden at home? Are you guys doing any gardening? Any any veggies in your garden there? We are doing a little bit of gardening in our front garden, and the squirrels are very much enjoying everything we're trying to make. <laughs> Well said. So if the squirrels, the raccoons, or the rabbits here uh, do not get all of our tasty treats, some of us. So I have a little condo. Uh, some of our tomatoes are starting to come through. So I've got a good-sized cherry tomato. So grape tomatoes might be a little too small for this. So these are cherry tomatoes. They can get up the size of a golf ball or a little bit bigger. And what you're going to do, you want to take out all the seeds, right? So all you want to do is take out the seeds, and essentially you want to make that nice and open, and, and uh, so you're going to fill that. Have you made homemade hummus before at home? Yes, yes, we have made homemade hummus. It's delicious. Just gonna move our little food processor in here. So we have our canola oil. So I've got two tablespoons of canola oil going in. Fresh chickpeas, so essentially buy them in the can or you can dry them, soak them overnight. But again, make your life easy. Make, uh, make it simple here. So we're gonna go our chickpea action, which is fantastic. Tahini. Tracy, the secret ingredient, little tahini. So uh, sesame, beautiful sesame paste, a little touch of salt and pepper, fresh black pepper in there. And we just wanna close that up. So guys, just like that, you've got now your own homemade hummus ready to go, which is amazing. So Trace, we've got our homemade hummus, which is fantastic. A little Ziploc bag, a little clear bag, a little a little closure bag, if you will. So what we want to do is make sure the air is out. I'm just going to take a little more air out of that, and we want to press it down. So essentially, you're creating the exact the exact same way as you would with your uh, if you were using an actual piping bag with a star tip. I'm going to hit it with a little bit of fresh, beautiful uh mint so again off my balcony in season it's going now so i'm gonna finish off here with our little bit of fresh uh pardon me a little bit of feta crumbled feta cheese and we want to hit it with a little bit of that beautiful 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 fresh mint you can smell that over here this is pretty much you could also drizzle a little bit of um evo or some more canola oil or something over the top but that is pretty much your next party favorite, ready to go. Healthy, seasonal, the cherry bombs. Go to cityline.tv for that recipe. We appreciate that.